Blessed name of people. So yesterday it was announced that Usain Bolt tested positive for a coronavirus. But at the time when the news come out, Usain Bolt made a video and I feel like that kind of helped to confuse a lot of persons. Now Usain Bolt at that time said that he was waiting on the result. You know him saying to the test basically because he might go up on some business move or something like that, right? So him never know whether or not him have it. Now basically what me feels that happened still people is that the news got leaked out. And basically a lot of persons learn the results before you see and both himself learn the result. So a lot of persons was saying that we are spread rumors, him never have it and stuff like that. Well now Minister Christopher Tufton came out and said yes, he tested positive, you understand? So basically this is what the article said. Minister of Health and Wellness Dr. Christopher Tufton has confirmed that Usain Bolt has tested positive for COVID-19 and he has been formally notified. So I guess maybe Usain Bolt are one of the last person to know. <laughs> I don't know people, but I mean, nobody now bash Usain Bolt. Well, I don't go say nobody, but most people now bash him. A lot of persons sympathize with him. Also with him young baby, you see me? A lot of persons are pray for the baby and I say hopefully the baby not have it or even his baby mother slash fiance. But I also see another thing on the internet, and boy, I may not know whether this real or Photoshop, but it is coming from the JPP, which is the Jamaica Progressive Party, and it says, Our prayers go out to the Bolt family and other families affected by this terrible virus. That said, Mr. Bolt should be charged after he recovers. So basically the JPP, and as I say people, I'm not sure whether or not this tweet is real, but it look real because I see it all over the internet. A lot of persons are talking about it and stuff but yeah them basically feel like you saying bolt should be charged after he recovers now i want to know how you feel about that do you agree with that because you don't know say if it was a regular person a lot of persons would be saying charge him to disobedient but of course you know you saying bolt popularity kind of rules in somewhat way and i even hear richie feelings talk about it well him never talk about it him just touch on the little part and him said that will never happen you saying bolt will not be charged jpp put up something saying you saying bolt should be charged that will never happen and if you understand all that stuff me around a majority run boy and a minority i'm sorry now people, I can't really say whether or not he's going to be charged. I am not a police, you understand? We have left that for the police. But I know that some form of investigation is being launched. Because I say something in the gleaner, but I never really read the article. Maybe I might touch on it later or tomorrow or whenever, you understand? But anyway, I also see a girl make a post saying, make sure him get charged like everyone else. So of course this person is in agreement with the JPP and wants Usain Bolt to be charged. And since we're looking and comments. Remember showing us some other comments where some people are say so a person said not to sound harsh but at that him forget they feel like they are above the law too much. Um an next person said the mistake was slack in the JLP of COVID. After a while I remember cases were like one a day and recoveries were like twenty. Jamaica felt it was over and the government let them have their way. That was the problem. He should have still placed the country under strict measures. You can't blame Jamaicans when we all thought COVID was under control. And the next person said, okay, so this is how it's going down. You saying has it? Then Beanie Man's daughter was at the party. Then she went to Beanie Man's birthday party, of course. She now give it to Beanie Man. Everybody at his party must have it. Now them gone home to Crystal, who is a part of PNP rally. Then she gone now to interact with all the other PNP supporters. Guys, just stay home and go bed. And since we're talking about Crystal Tomlinson, I see she put up something on Instagram. And let me show you. It says, following reports that a member of her family has come in contact with someone who is confirmed to have contracted the COVID-19 virus, Crystal Tomlinson has gone into self-quarantine and is now awaiting results from tests conducted earlier today. While she is experiencing no symptoms related to the virus, at this time, she has decided to remain in self-quarantine and halt all campaign-related activities until her results are available. Tomlinson, who is the PNP candidate for West Rural St. Andrew, will no longer participate in the upcoming social issues debate scheduled for August the 25th. And she also said... 
thank you for all the calls, messages, and comments to let us know we are in your prayers. Until I am sure that it is safe to be on the road again, I will remain in self-quarantine. We will move our campaign online to allow our constituents to have full view of our plans and visions for building. So yes, people, and obviously I you know that is because Disha Ravers was at the party with Ding Dong, and obviously she went to Beanie Man party just like what the people them say. So I guess maybe Beanie Man in isolation as well. I remember say other people did there the same party, and I know them must interact and talk to each other. But they say Popcorn was there, Bunchy Killer was there, and I mean the people them never did a wear mask. And I don't know people, I feel like everybody just needs to play them role. Regardless if you're around 5 people or if you're around 50 people, you must can do that for a while because obviously even last night I hear our 80 something more cases in a one day and the day before that 116. So the cases them are no longer 1, 1 and 2, 2 anymore. We can see so we pass them region there. So I plead and I beg and I ask the people them for just do the right thing. I even watch the news last night. And me hear like them, I said the worst is yet to come. You see me? Sound a bit scary. And boy, I'm telling me, even I think me even see something like them, I run out of beds. And since we talk about bed, me say somebody make a post. And this is so true. I believe this post. So them say, well, I one thing me I go tell you now. If 10 people need a ventilator and only two at the hospital, Bolt will get one. And one definitely need to stay on the yard because. Bolt will get one. I'm have to agree with that. You understand? So the best thing for the people them though, don't put yourself in a position where you know somebody make you a choice and choose whether or not to get a ventilator. Just try to do the right thing. But yeah, people, leave in the comments and make me know when you think about this. And also, what do you think about the JPP saying that Usain Bolt should be charged after he recovers? Do you think that will happen? Do you think that he should be charged just like if another person would be charged? Leave it in the comment section. Anyway, people, bless upon yourself. Stay safe. I'm out.